Hi, everyone. Good evening. Nice to see you here. Hello, Anna. Good evening. Hello, Wendy. Good evening. I hope you're doing well. How was your day at work, Oscar? Did you work today, Oscar? Today is a day very hard for me. Why? Uh, I was sleeping only two hours. Oh and, my God. And don't, and don't have to go to sleep uh, temporarily. Early. Why? Why haven't you slept? Uh, I have to work uh, and have, I have many, 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 many situations. Uh, by don't don't get, don't don't get to I imagine Oscar but it's it's good to have you here it looks like you really had a very difficult time and you're still in the class I'm glad to see you here and I'm glad to see all of you here I will take the attendance so let's begin Ana Beatriz. Present teacher. Ana Lilian. Brian Javier. Carlos Antonio. Present. Thank you, Jose Arnoldo. Jose Galileo. Jose Jonathan. Present. Ah, okay. Present. Thank you. Present. Thank you, Jonathan. Rodrigo Hernandez. Juan Carlos Rivas, Laura Carolina. Present teacher. Present, okay, Present teacher. Thank you, Laura and Rodrigo. María Concepción, María Elena, Mayra Veralice, Nelson Gabarrete, Omar Present, Francisco. Miss. Thank you. Omar Francisco. Oscar Arnulfo, okay. Zaira Marleni. Present Wendy. teacher. Okay. Wendy Maribel. Present. Present. Jenny Santos. Okay, so let's begin. In this moment, we will have a little review. I'm going to ask you some questions about the last two units, about unit number one and unit number two. Vamos a tener un pequeño review de, de lo que hemos estudiado hasta ahorita. About the restaurant industry. So let's begin with Ana. Okay, Ana. Tell me three parts that a menu must contain. Three parts a menu has to contain. Tres partes que un menú tiene que contener. Three parts a menu has to contain. Uh, images and frames. Presentation. Uh -huh. uh, presentation, presentation. When you did the menu, cuando hicieron el menu, le pusieron estas partes. Do you remember those parts? There uh, were five. A number, a number de latillo, no sé cómo sería, dishes. Hmm? Dishes. Ah, nombre uh -huh. de dishes. Ajá. Uh -huh. Imágenes. ¿Qué sería? Como presentación sería. Teacher. The presentation. Ajá, uh -huh. presentation. Okay. And price. And the price. Ok, Ana, yes. thank you. Son otras. There are other ones, but thank you for your comment. Let's see, Jonathan. Do you remember? You were not in that class. You were just the jury. Esa clase, recuerdo que no estaba y fue jurado. You were a jury. But do you remember or you don't? Price? Prices? Uh-huh. Um, dishes? Um, presentation? Okay, Jonathan, thank you, but no, it's not that. Let's ask Carlos. Carlos, do you remember three parts of the menu? Started. Uh-huh, or appetizers, correct. Dresses. 
Desserts. Mm -hmm. Desserts. Um, drinks. Drinks, correct. Uh -huh. Those were the ones I was talking about. Those are essential parts of a menu. Do you remember the other two, Nelson? Do you remember? Uh, main course. Main course, S yes. Snacks. Snacks. Uh -huh. uh, drinks. Yes. Uh, dish, dishes. Dishes, correct. Uh -huh. Good memory. Okay, next question. Okay, there is Wendy. One question for you, Wendy. Another way to say a group, a group of five. The other option, ¿cuál era la otra manera para decir eso? A group of five. There's another option. Party? Uh -huh. A party of five. Yes. Thank you, Wendy. Okay, now let's ask Galileo. Okay, Galileo, question. Another way to say to reserve. There's another option we use a lot to mean that, to reserve a spot in the restaurant. Mm. Book table. Yes, uh -huh. that's the one. To book, and then you mention what you need. To book a table at 7 p.m., etc. Yes, Galileo, thank you. Okay, now question for, are you there, Ellie? Yes, I, I am. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. So Ellie, what is a takeout? What is that? Takeout. Take out. Take out. Do you remember that word? Se recuerda la esa orden. palabra? Order. Hacer la orden. Me, me... Again, please. La, no sé cómo se dice en inglés, teacher. But what do you mean or what do you want to say? La order. 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 But what else? Only solo la orden que toma el mutero. Ah, uh, no. No, Eli, it's different. Let's see, Rodrigo, do you remember that word, take out? If you can tell us the English definition, it will be better. You don't, okay. Do you remember, uh, Oscar? Do you remember the word take out? I no. I don't remember. Laura, take out. No remember, teacher. <laughs> no. <laughs> Who remembers? Uh, Galileo. Teacher, take, take out. Take out mean uh, buy it to go. Uh huh. Thank you, Galileo. Jonathan, what did you want to say? Do you still have a comment? Uh, the microphone, Jonathan. Maybe eat in house. When you eat, uh huh. Yes, thank you, Jonathan. So uh, yes, you you buy the food in the restaurant, but you eat the food in another place, your house, a friend's house, but not in the restaurant. That is the takeout. Okay, uh, next question. One moment, let me look at this. Teacher. Yes. Es, es, es eso como significado así como comer fuera. Algo así, no. O uh, take care. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Para llevar. Ah, para. Ok. Another Delivery. option. Delivery. <laughs> Delivery. Oh, no. Delivery. <laughs> People say to go. It's a very common phrase. I want a hamburger to go. 
Oh, okay. uh, it's a very common phrase people use. Okay, then let's talk about strategies. Are you there, Brian? Brian? Yeah, teacher. Uh, hi, Brian. Good evening. We are having a review about promotional strategies. Can you mention one promotional strategy? Puede mencionar una estrategia promocional? We studied like five of them last week. Vimos como cinco last week. Mm. Mm. Es como, como presentaríamos. Um, I'm sorry, one more time. Es como, como presentaríamos algo nuevo, digamos, es algo así. A eso uh -huh. se yeah, when we were talking about introducing a new product, cuando hablábamos de introducir nuevos productos, y que habían Maybe opciones. Which one? Maybe the network. Social, social networks. Social okay, network. all right. Thank you, Brian. Anna, do you have another idea? Another strategy? And is use technology in your digital? Uh, mobile health the uh, always works in promotion. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Anna. Those are some ideas. And we, we did this in the class. Here you have the names, the names of the, of the promotional strategies. We have publicity stunts, bundling, public relations, loyalty offerings and sampling. So those are some, some options. Okay, but moving forward, I'm just going to go to the page. Okay, we will talk about uh, this, page 18 in the book, page number 18. And we continue talking about procedures, right? Estábamos hablando ahora de procedures. And in this moment, we will work in groups. Here we have five procedures, sorry, six, six procedures. And here we have the definition or the description. The idea is that in groups, groups of three, you try to figure out which is the the name or the definition for each one. Vamos a hablar de procedimientos y ahorita vamos a ver otros, otras palabras. Oops, like the ones we, we studied yesterday. Vamos a trabajar en grupos de tres y van a tratar de encontrar la respuesta. ¿Cuál pertenece a, a dónde? And later, when we return, we will check. Y cuando regresen, vamos a ver, ¿verdad? para estar seguros que tenemos la respuesta correcta. Así que aquí están como la, los procedimientos. Towing, food, hand washing, sanitizing, food storage, purchase, and tasting method. Y aquí están las definiciones. Okay. So we have to look for the right one. That is what we have to do. Do you have a question before I, I create the rooms? Picture. Mm -hmm. Yes, Brian. Please, please show our picture in yes. what top, please. The picture of the book. Or... Yes. Okay. All right. I will create. I will send you the, the picture. And Next. okay, let me create the rooms. And you will receive the invite in, in one moment.
under your fingernails. Right. I think the first description yes. is letter B. In that order. Is the primera letter B is a uh, unwishing. 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 What do you think, Omar? Nelson. Hello. Hi. Hi, teacher. Hi, guys. Sorry to interrupt. Galileo, I just wanted to let you know that Arnoldo can't make it in this class. And Maybe. you have the next one in the list Maybe. for the private okay. session. Yeah. Can you stay tonight? Yes, I am. Oh, agree. Okay. I agree. Okay, good. So I, I just wanted to check on that. Uh, all right. See you in a moment. Bye bye. Okay. Bye. Descriptions. Hi everyone. Hey. Yeah, Bill. Hi. Hi, teacher. Hey, teacher. Do you need help? Or I don't know. Is there something I could help you with? For this moment. Darwin. Uh, I win okay. with we the man. Towing. Towing. Uh, that is when the action, for example, you have chicken in the freezer and you yes. remove it, you take it from the kit, from the freezer, and you wait for the chicken to be warm. That is the meaning of towing defrosting something. Es como cuando uno saca algo a descongelar. Lo deja fuera, mm. ¿verdad? Hasta que se... Sí, Ajá, eso es lo de towing. Ajá, como descongelar. Productos, towing. Ajá, try. Yo sé que hay casi, pues, muchas palabras nuevas y, y términos raros. Así que traten y, y luego vamos a corroborar en el otro room. I'll try to get it okay. as much as you can get. Okay. okay, anything else I could help you with? Okay. No. No. no, no. Okay, in two minutes we will return. Yeah, ya vamos a terminar juntos. Okay, see you. Hi everyone, welcome back. In this moment, we will check together. We will check together and I will help you in case you need with new vocabulary and, and pronunciation. Let's practice pronunciation a little bit before we start okay, with at least some of you. Okay, I'm going to say it first three times and then some of you are going to repeat. So number one is thawing, thawing, food, thawing, hand washing, hand washing, hand washing, sanitizing, oops, sanitizing, sanitizing, food storage, 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 purchase, 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 tasting, tasting method, tasting method, 
tasting method. Okay, so let's see, Saira, please repeat. Are you here, Saira? No. Um, okay, let's try louder. Could you please repeat? Okay, este. Twiting full. Towing. Towing, towing. Towing full. Hand washing. Sanitizing. Mm -hmm. Food storage. Orchards. Tasting med metal. Method. Okay, very Metal. good. Good pronunciation, Laura. Uh, Excuse me, teacher. No me agarraba el, el, el micrófono. Ah, ah, that is what happened. I thought you were not here. Okay. <laughs> Zaira, can you please repeat? Towing food, hand washing, sanitary time, sanitizing. Food. Sanitizing, mm -hmm. food storage, purchase, testing method. Purchasing, uh -huh. good job, just that one. Purchase, sorry, purchase. Purchase, purchase. Yes. Thank you, Saira. Now let's listen okay, to teacher. Omar. Omar, could you repeat, please? Repeat. Mm -hmm. Okay. Towing food. Con continue, Omar. Storage. Purchase. Justing method. Uh, tasting. Tasting method. Thank you, Omar. Good pronunciation. Just the last one. Tasting. But besides that, very well. Now let's listen to Oscar. Oscar, can you please repeat? Excuse me. What is Aiden? I'm sorry. You want to know the meaning of towing or the pronunciation? What did you say, Oscar? I'm I, sorry. I trouble, I trouble with my with my connection. Ah, okay. You don't hear. Okay. All right. Then Maida, can you repeat, please? Okay. Towing food, hand washing, sanitizing, food, food storage, mm -hmm. purchase, tasting metal. Yes, good pronunciation. They are all correct. And Juan Carlos, last one last time, Juan Carlos, please. De, la digo todas, no la escuché. Ah, you didn't. Okay. Okay. Uh, Towing food, ah, language, sanitizing, food storage, porches and testing method. Mm -hmm. Good pronunciation as well. Thank you, Juan Carlos. Let's maybe try. Okay, try again, Oscar, yes. If you can, you uh, can. Showing food, hand washing, sanitizing, food storage, purchase, testing metal. Thank you, Oscar. Okay, this one is the towing, towing food. Purchase and tasting. That's that's the way it sounds. Okay, now the definitions, and I can help you if you need new vocabulary. We will start with Rodrigo. What do you think is towing forth? What could be the definition, Rodrigo? Number one, or letter A in this case. No, what your hand? Yes. 
No. Oh, oh. Towing. Oh, that's a definition. Uh -huh. For ah, towing eh, food. Sería descongelar alimento. Uh, what is the comida? definition? Can you read the definition that we have in the book? Ah, okay, okay, mm -hmm. okay, okay. Please. Eh, sería uh, to let frozen food become warmer until it's ready to cook. Thank you. Thank you very much, Rodrigo. Jonathan, do you have the same opinion? Same yes, as Rodrigo? Well, yes, that's true. Okay, so the thank you. Will become warmer until it is ready. So when food, correct. Okay, so there we have it. Next one, can you continue? Let me see, Jonathan. I'm sorry, Jonathan. Yes, uh, yes, letter B. Letter B, hand washing. Wash your hands and forearms with soap. Use a brush to clean under your fingernails dry. Okay, thank you, Jonathan. Uh, Galileo, do you agree? Yes, hand washing. I agree. Same. Okay, yes. same definition. That's, that's the one, hand washing, thank you. Now, Carlos, sanitizing, what would be the definition? Sanitizing, equipment is washed, rinsed and disinfected. After ash, dish is prepared. Thank you, Carlos. I will help you with the pronunciation of some words. This one is washed. Desinfected. Desinfected. Uh -huh. Each. Each. Prepared. 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 Yes. Okay, Carlos. Thank you. Now, what do you think, Elena? Sanitizing. I am seeing the same. The same as Carlos. Yes. Okay, thank you. This is correct. That's the one. Now let's continue with Brian. Okay, Brian. Food storage. Food storage. Mm -hmm. There are three possibilities. One, two, or three. Um. Do you have any ideas? El alimento de, ¿cómo es? El almacén de comida, el de alimento. Ajá, ajá, es, that's the idea. Um, es que esa no la puede hacer, pero. Okay, if you couldn't, that's okay. I know that we had some, um, some. Employees. Um, uh, food storage employees who receive and storage food organize eating in the correct place to avoid battery. Thank Maybe. you, Brian. I will, I will help you with two words. The one here is items. Items, that's the pronunciation, and bacteria. Can you please repeat those two words? Are you there, Brian? <laughs> Can you repeat? Items, bacteria. Items, bacteria. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Brian. Okay. Okay, Let's you. check with Laura this time. Food storage. Do you have the same opinion as Brian? Or do you have a different opinion? Similar opinion, teacher. Similar, the same. Sí. Okay, same. thank you, Laura. And that is the one. This will be considered food storage, the definition for that one. And then, okay, purchase. Can you continue, Omar? What is the definition for purchase? By package food only from listen supply. Mm -hmm. Correct. 
Thank you. Uh, Galileo, is it the pronunciation? You mean the pronunciation of that one? I just read the message. The option uh, five. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, that's you, right. You that's want right. to know but the pronunciation? Please. Rinsed. 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 Uh -huh. Rinsed. Correct. Thank that you. is the pronunciation. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Thank you. Okay. You're welcome. Okay. Now, let's see. Anna, what? Um, what could be the definition for purchase? The same, the same Omar mentioned, or do you have yes, a different thing? The, the same, same, the Omar, yes. Same, so, okay, the one here, right? To buy package food, thank you. And then we have just one, one more to go. Uh, Ellie, can you read the definition for tasting method, please? Mm, yes, teacher. Take a sample. Take, take a sam sample of the food you want to taste, taste it on a spoon. Cook the sample on a second spoon away from the cooking air and taste the product. Thank you, Ellie. I will help you with two words. Taste. Taste. Spoon. Spoon. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. And yes. Okay, so there we have them. Do you still have questions about the vocabulary? No sé si han quedado algunas dudas o algo que no es, se entiende qué significa. I can try to help you. Wendy, questions? Jonathan, Jenny, Nelson? Meet each other. Yes, um, where, where is the meaning of the finger? Fingers. Body? Okay, these are your fingers. Fingers. Uh, nails. Fingernails. Uh, mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so are you sure? Estamos bien? Entendemos los procedures? Zaira, questions? Si entendemos que es el tasting method. Oh. Ajá, Zaira. Rinse, ¿cómo dijo que se pronunciaba? Rinse. Rinse. Mm -hmm. Rinse. ¿Qué es? ¿Qué es? Teacher? Rinse is very similar to, to washing something, like when it has a lot of a lot of, um, I forgot this word in English. Es como cuando algo tiene detergente. Oh. Ajá, esa, esa action, eso sería rinsed. Rinsed. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. Okay, so if you Thanks. don't have questions, let's continue with this. We will work on this individually. No lo vamos a trabajar en parejas. We will do it individually. And it says, choose one of the procedures, only one, not two. One of the procedures you follow every day at your workplace. Create a mini poster to present the procedure. Okay, so what do you have to do? Van a crear como un poster Podrían hacerlo en PowerPoint or Word. It's okay. And you have to create the talk about one procedure you follow. Tienen que hablar de un procedimiento que ustedes siguen en su trabajo. Okay, aquí hay unos que tienen que ver con restaurants. Okay, purchase y qué, qué hacen con ese procedure. O oh, bueno, con el COVID, COVID-19. Hay un procedure también ahora, ¿verdad? En las compañías. What you have to do. Okay. So you have to think about one procedure. Piensen en algo que tienen que hacer y how you follow. ¿Cómo lo siguen? Do you have doubts? ¿Tienen alguna duda? ¿De ese poster que van a hacer? No tiene, que que ser, no tiene que ser ninguno de lo, de lo que está ahí, ¿verdad? De lo que no. vamos a ver. No. Okay. Not necessarily. If you want to, you can choose one of them that apply to your company. 
si aplica alguno a su compañía, podría. Porque es de algo que usted eh, siga, ¿verdad? En su workplace. Ok. ¿Hm? Eli, did you have yo, a question? Yo... Ah, Mayra. Yes, Mayra. Sí. Eso lo vamos a hacer ahorita, teacher. Uh -huh. Oh, no. Right. Es que yo no tengo la computadora a la mano. Ok, notebook. Notebook ahí. Bonito, Mayra, y picture. Y me lo envía. No ajá, problem. Ajá, ajá. Uh -huh. okay. Any other questions? Poster de un procedimiento. Ajá. Si? That you follow at your workplace. Ok, um, estamos viendo que muchas compañías tienen procedimientos, ¿verdad? Que siguen cada día. Así como ayer veíamos qué significaba una acción, los steps o pasos que se siguen. Por ejemplo, el COVID-19. Para el COVID-19, ahora muchos restaurants en companies tienen un procedure que siguen, un protocolo que se sigue. Por ejemplo... Yeah. Entonces, tiene que escoger uno, Wendy, de que su compañía sigue para vender un boleto, un para recibir un pago. Uh... ¿Cómo su compañía lo uh -huh. eh, tiene el protocolo o, o los pasos para hacerlo? Como el orden o los pasos. Ajá, ajá. Y menciona uh... cuál es el procedure. Y, pero es que me confundo, creo que la palabra poster, o sea, yo pensé que era como una publicidad que íbamos a hacer de eso o algo así. No, pero no es así, ¿verdad? Poster Sino que son como... todos los pasos. Ajá, como un document donde me ponga ahí, por ejemplo, sanitizing y luego el, el procedure that you follow. Oh. Y luego el procedimiento que sigue. Oh. Uh -huh. Viene okay. quedando quizás como sí, un sí. paragraph. Ah, ok. Thank you. Yes. Teacher, Mayra. soy yo de nuevo. Otra pregunta <laughs> yes. que es Yes, ask. Así como yo que, que en mi empresa soy auxiliar contable, entonces no sé, tendría que, puedo eh, como hacer el proceso de, de algo que yo hago, ¿cómo? Ahí sí uh -huh. no, me perdí. Yes, for example, the way you check the books, algo que ustedes tengan que hacer mensualmente. And what is the procedure? ¿Y cuál es el proceso que siguen para, para ver contabilidad en alguna área? Uh -huh. En specific area. Ok. Uh -huh. Hoy sí, teacher. Ok. Gracias. If you have more questions, you can ask. No problem.
Teacher, a question. Uh, what's, yes. the, what's the meaning? Write in computer. I, I, I will send it in the chat. T T A P E T Y uh, T Y P E. Thank you. Yes, you're welcome. Okay, I, I am receiving um, the, the posters or the procedures you, you have selected. If you have finished, you can send it to me by chat here or by WhatsApp. I'm checking them in this moment. And for the ones who already finished, I'm going to send you an invite. Okay, if you already finished, you can go to the other room and you can continue planning your role play. Okay, yo voy a seguir este leyendo y analizando sus, sus posters y los que ya terminaron pueden aceptar una invite que les voy a enviar para que terminen de planear su, su role play. If you already finished, a todos les va a aparecer. Just don't accept it if you haven't finished. Solo no lo acepten hasta que ya hayan terminado. So, Carlos, in your case, you were working with Zaira, right? But Zaira, Zaira aún no ha terminado. Not yet. Okay. So, you can stay here, Carlos, if you want to, or you can go there in the meantime, because Zaira hasn't, hasn't finished yet. In WhatsApp, send in WhatsApp. Yes, yes, you can send it to me by WhatsApp or you can send it here. I'm checking both, both channels.
Okay, so if you have finished, please accept the invite and I will give you feedback, feedback about your poster as soon as I, I read the, the info. But there's the invite. Yes, Laura. Este, los pasos que la, la primera tarea eh, se la tenemos que mandar a usted. Se mm. la tengo que mandar, teacher. El poster. Al, al WhatsApp. O no. Ajá, eso. Uh, <laughs> teacher, pero si yes, son, unos procedimientos, si son unos procedimientos sencillos, okay. igual tiene que llevar un muñeco. No, no, it's not necessary. Not necessary. No, lo okay. que es importante ahí es su, su grammar. Eso es lo que estamos ahí viendo. Uh -huh. Así que no, it's not necessary. Y la, y la segunda tarea que dijo. Uh, okay. which one? Lo que está haciendo ahorita lo, los demás. Ajá, eso. Ah. <laughs> ¿Qué era? La continuación este. de la de ayer. Ahorita los que ya terminaron esto van a ir a terminar su role play. Entonces algunos ya no están acá porque ya están ah, okay. empezando a trabajar en el role play que ayer dejamos empezado, por decirlo así. Ajá. Okay. Y ah, yo me ¿y quedo esta aquí. esta tarea leyendo. dónde se la están mandando, pues, teacher? WhatsApp y aquí en ah. el chat. Como es un póster, entonces aquí lo estoy leyendo yo. Se puede subir póster, teacher, aquí en hacia al abrir el chat. Ah, no, tiene que o sea, enviar la presentación el de PowerPoint. Ah, ah, pues sí, eso sí, a WhatsApp. Ah, bueno, entonces en el chat se lo voy a poner la hojita. Teacher, y puede ser como una imagen. Ajá, it can be a picture. Laura, if you wish, mejor mándemelo en WhatsApp. Please send it to me by WhatsApp. Si sí, es un document, el que va a mandar. Una página de PowerPoint. <risa> ah, ok. Ah, pues, yes, ah, please. Send it to me by WhatsApp. Ya la envío. Ok. Yo estaba con Rodrigo en el anterior, pero no sé si él ya está solito trabajando. <risa> ya se fue, Rodrigo. <risa> ya le está esperando allá. Ah, pues como me incluyo con como me incluyo con él. <risa> I sent the invitation, Laura. No le llegó. Si ah, no okay. se la vuelvo a enviar. Eh, por favor, porque me salí, creo como me quedé yo sola. <risa> <risa> ok, don't no worry. Sé, Two invitations you, le van a caer. You. Uh -huh. You're okay. welcome. Ah, eh, ok, and Jonathan, you will be working with Mayra. This time, okay, because you were not here yesterday and her partner is not here. You were working with Lily, right? But Lily is not here. So. Teacher, pero yo ya lo hice. O sea, bueno, lo, ajá, lo terminé yo, pues hice lo, yo lo tengo hecho. O sea, ah. yo se lo envié incluso. Y por eso estoy ahorita, ya logré conseguir con Fu y estoy haciendo bonito ese que dejo ahorita. O sea, ah, el otro yo ya lo hice. You're ready uh -huh. finish. Ah, el okay. otro sí, pero el del póster no. Ajá, que es the one you sent by chat was the, the one about the Friday dialogue, right? The one you sent to me in the morning that I read. Uh -huh. Ajá, ese ah, fue ese el, el, el otro, Friday. Dice. Pero uh -huh. el otro ya está. Con Ana Lilian, sí. Uh -huh. Ah, ok, you have it. 
Ok, sí, can you please? Sí, eran todos los días juntos, casi. <laughs> yes, a lot of role plays. Ok, can you give that role play with Jonathan? Because uh, Lily is not here. Can you present the role play with Jonathan? Um, este, le, le voy a decir, y Jonathan ahí está. No, Jonathan is not here. But I can send you the invite so you can go there. Ah, ok, sí. Y si quiere me la manda a teacher porque como me salí, ya no me sale. ¿va? <laughs> yes, yes, bueno. two invitations. This is the first okay. one. And I'm going to send you the, the second one. Me sorry, le di en el botoncito. Okay, Yo... yeah. I will send you. I will send you to the room, Jonathan. Just okay, accept so. the invite. Okay. Me too, teacher. Me you too. too. Oh, it was a mistake. I thought you had already finished. And that is why you were here. And Nelson, you haven't received the, the invite either. No le ha caído su invitación, Nelson. No. Eh, let me see. Ah, con Galileo, ¿verdad? Si los dos están acá. Ok. Van a lle llegar los two invites. This is number one. And then the other one. I got it. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hi, did you finish? No, not yet. <laughs> I brought you back because I have to take the attendance. So that is why. But Juan Carlos, how are you and Jenny doing? No, sorry, you're working with Omar, right? 
Yes, Omar, and ah. Arnoldo. Uh -huh. Arnoldo couldn't come. He sent me a message. He told me that uh, her, well, his best friend's son died. So he's in the funeral. So it sounds. Okay. So sad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very hard. Hi, everyone. I, I brought you back because I have to take the attendance. And then maybe you can give me a follow up to see how you're doing. Okay, so Ana Beatriz. Present. Ana Lilian. Brian Javier. Present. Carlos Antonio. Present. Elizabeth Martinez. Uh, not here in this moment. Arnoldo. No, Galileo, uh, Galileo Barrera. Present. Jonathan Vigil. Present. Jose Rodrigo. Juan Carlos. Present. Okay. Laura Carolina. Present. María Concepción. Mayra Moreno. Present teacher. Nelson Gabarrete. Present Miss. Omar Francisco. Present. Oscar Arnulfo. Present. Zaira Marlene. Present teacher. Eh, Wendy Maribel. Present teacher. And Jenny Suleima. Present. Okay, so guys, how are you doing? How is the role play going? Have you Check. finished? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, Elena, what did you say? No sé si me mencionó. Yes, yes, I did. Pero aquí le agrego. It's okay. Gracias. Okay, so has anybody finished or not yet? ¿Hay algún grupo? Carlos? Yes. Okay, good. Galileo yes. y Nelson, you too. Yes. Who else? Alguien más? No. Okay, I'm going to give you just a couple of minutes while we will, while I listen to these two pairs. Voy a dar unos minutitos más en lo que escucho a ellos. So maybe in three or four minutes, um, you can return, guys. But Carlos and you guys don't go. Carlos, Zaira, don't go. Nelson, Galileo, stay here. Uh -huh. Reject, reject the invite. Ustedes sí pueden rechazarla, ¿verdad? Porque ya terminaron. But the other ones, they can, they can go and finish. Okay, so Carlos and Zaira, can you present your conversation? We will give you the spotlight to both of you. Oops. Oh, okay, there it is. And okay. Carlos, okay. I had a claim for the service. Excuse me, <laughs> the mute <laughs> the microphone. <laughs> I can help you. Service is very long and the wire is not polite. I see. Thank you for your opinion. It's very important for the restaurant. My food took a long time, more than normal. Sorry. The restaurant is full for a party. The attitude of the waiter bothered me more and not so much the weight. The waiter is not polite? No, it's very polite. I recommend the training. Yes, the training is very important for the employees. Again, sorry for the bad experience in, in this restaurant. I will offer do you discount on our next visit. Okay, thank you. Only that teacher. Finish teacher. Thank you. Thank you very much, Carlos and Zaira. I I like the part where Zaira says I recommend a training for your employee. <laughs> that is wow. She's recommending the training. So that's excellent. 
I'm going to help you with some Thank parts. You, teacher. Guys, can you please share the document again, Carlos? I, I am going to help you with some little changes. It's about questions. I'm going to request the control of the document so I can I can show you. Yes. Okay. So okay, here you have to make a change when it's That's a question. Llamar, when it's a question, you can say, can, can I help you? Or how can I help you? That would be the appropriate way to say it. And the same here, where it says manager, the waiter is not polite. In, in this case, you could say, isn't, isn't, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Isn't, I'm sorry. Isn't the waiter polite? And this would be the, the right way to put it. Da porque está como un poco sorprendido el manager con la actitud del, del waiter. Entonces como que no, no está siendo educado, algo así, ¿verdad? Es lo que queremos dar a entender. Entonces vamos a utilizar el, el negative form. Y aquí sería no. His. He is. No, he is very. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. No, he isn't very polite. I recommend the training. Okay. And then just that. Okay. Only those, those comments. But thank you, Carlos. Carlos thank and you, Okay, I'm going teacher. to remove the spotlight and now we can continue with Galileo, Galileo and Nelson. Okay, ma. okay. may I share Hello. my screen? Ma? Yes. Ah, okay. Yes, you can do it. Okay. Uh, the topic is the customer is angry because any waiter is closer to him to offer mm -hmm. the menu about 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, Nelson. Okay. Will you please come here? Sir, may I help you? I have been sitting here for duty menu and anybody can to me uh, to offer you menu. I'm so sorry, sir. My bad. Please let me reward your patient. What do you doing? I can't recover my last time in this place. Yes, sir, I understand you. Please let me give you these free starters while, while you take the menu and decide your favorite dish. Okay, how do you think I uh, started going to Reward the wedding time? No, sir. I don't think so. Yet, please take the menu. Let me know your order, and I am going to talk with, with the restaurant manager, and I am sure we will be able to give at least 50% off in your whole payment. Really, sounds good. My appreciation for my reaction. Any problem, sir? My apologies. It was my bad. Any problem? Thank you for being so clever. I'm happy okay. to help you. Mm -hmm. Excellent. I like that Nelson tried to change his voice, right? To sound a little bit angry. So I like that. And <laughs> I like that you use yet as bad. So you applied, you applied what you what we have been working on. I'm going to request the oh. control uh, so I can give you some feedback. But yes, I like that you use yet over here as a bat and the punctuation is also excellent. Maybe only two comments, patience. Okay. That is the, the right pronunciation, patience. I think it's at the beginning. Patience. Ah, okay, here. Okay. Thank you for your patience. And over here, 
we have two words, apologize and apologies. In this case, we have Apolo to say, my apologies. My, my apologies. Ajá, uh -huh. my apologies. Uh, my apologies. Ajá, uh -huh. pero como noun, como sustantivo, ¿verdad? Las disculpas del caso, uh -huh. my apologies. I apologize yes. como una action. Da que yo me disculpo, the verb. So, just okay. those two changes. Ajá, uh -huh. aquí está bien, my apologize for my reaction. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you, Galileo. Nelson, thank you, ma'am. I appreciate your help. Can you continue, Jenny and uh, Omar? I think it was Omar, right? Yes. But I, Omar, are you here, Omar? No, me. No, it's Oscar. Ah, Oscar. Ah, okay. Sí, es que se salió, verdad, de la clase un ratito y me desapareció del breakup room. Um, supervisor, hello, can I help you? What is the problem? I have a problem that this is not available, but it's a menu. What is the dish? It is lasagna with Morocco. The dish is a seasonal food by the special ingredients, but I could give you the lasagna with shrimp. Cher it is our specialty. But in the you show in this dish in the menu. And the the menu doesn't update yet. I could give you a receipt for the drawback. Okay, no problem. Excellent idea. I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> My microphone now. Thank you, Jenny and Oscar. Good job. I like the presentation too, a different, a different problem. And I was looking and reading, reading with you. I'm going to request the remote control so I can I can show you some changes. Uh, okay, so here where it says unavailable, it will be on. It's unavailable. That is the, the correct way to say it. It's not a but, ah, uh, pero aquí ya le habían puesto is not. Entonces puede ir ya así. It's not available, ¿verdad? De no disponible. Mm. Como no disponible, entonces pueden decir is unavailable, pero como ya está el negative, ya sería available. Ajá, uh -huh. just that, and then it's very well. It's very well done. So thank you. Thank you, guys. Now, Brian and Wendy, could you continue? Brian and Wendy? Okay, teacher. <laughs> Brian. Yes. Hello. Okay. Excuse me. Excuse me. How can I help you? Hungry because wider group life and who is the bad thing? Oh, sorry so much for this problem. You are a good client. Don't worry, your food is free. Come back later, please. Have a good day. And sorry again. Okay, thank you. Have a nice day. 
Thank you. Okay. Thank you. You are a very good manager, Wendy. So free, free food for the customer. Uh -huh. And he yeah. is going to be happy. Así se va a alegrar. And dessert, better. But just one question. I didn't understand the problem. What was the problem in the conversation, Wendy or Brian? I couldn't hear that part well. Brian? The waiter uh, does, does not like with clients. A Brian no le gustó el, el, cam, el camarero, el waiter. Yes. ¿Cómo lo atendió? Yes. Mejor camarero, porque camarero no. Ah, ok. All right. So maybe you can say that he didn't like the, the service. Ok. I don't like the service provided mm -hmm. by the waiter. Okay, but thank you. Thank you very much. Now, Rodrigo and Laura, can you continue, please? Okay. Rodrigo. Ya está compartiendo, teacher. Ah, ok. Rodrigo. Yes. Are you no, here, Rodrigo? No, no lo escucho. No, I think he's not here. Oh, yes, yes, he's here. I think he's, he's trying to activate the the microphone. But me, okay, yes. Rodrigo. Yes. Now we hear you. Okay, okay, okay. Hear me. Good evening. It's a pleasure server. My name is Rodrigo. Good evening, Rodrigo. Have you brought the chair went for? Yes, I bought a, a table a day this Susan O'Connor for this evening. I'm sorry, I don't see a reservation in your name. Please tell me who took your reservation. I don't remember the waiter name that took to call, but do you have any free table? Please, excuse me, a few minutes for talk while my supervisor for solve the problem. It's okay. I'm sorry, but the weather broke down your reservation for another day. Can you help me? What solution do you give me? Oh, on behalf of the restaurant, we apologize for the error. We will guide you the beep room and free dessert. It's great. You can accompany us to the table, please. Are they ready to order or do they need a few minutes? Mm, they need a few minutes. Will the, will the they like some time to drink? Will they like to taste the wing? Yes, may you bring a bottle of wine and five bottles with water, please. Right away. Okay, thank you. Only. Thank you, Laura <laughs> and Rodrigo. Good job. And I could see that you did it. Veo que lo habían hecho bastante a su manera. Uh -huh. Menos Google Translate. I like yeah. that. Hoy that pensamos, sí. <laughs> oh, Hoy no hizo okay. trabajar. Hoy no hizo trabajar. <laughs> That's the idea. To, okay, to practice. Yes. And sí, just yes. with the pronunciation, uh, just these two words. VIP, okay. that is the correct pronunciation. VIP. Uh, mm -hmm. The VIP room. Or the VIP room. room. And the other one is wine. 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 Uh -huh. wine. Okay. Wine. okay. Thank you. Now, okay. Ana and Elena, can you continue? Yes. 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 Yes
Yes, teacher. Yes. Sorry, Marjolina. Uh, good afternoon. How can I help you? Uh, the, the dish one to other is not available. Did its appears listens in the menu? I'm sorry for inconvenience. I want to speak with the manager. Okay, and this moment, call her. No, sorry. Mm. No. Oh. Ellie. Ellie. Ellie? No, Ellie is not here. Maybe she lost the connection. Um, I will be Ellie. I will be Ellie okay. to, to help you. Okay, Ellie manager, right? Yes. yes. Okay, good afternoon. I'm Ellie, the manager. My partner comments, com, uh, tells me about the inconvenience. I, I asking about the dish that is on the menu, but it stands me that there is not longer. And I don't think it's a viable, I don't understand. Why is still uppers on the list? I don't understand this situation. Um, I could serve other this you. Uh, what, what one of the menu server a dessert for inconvenience? Okay, it be great. I want chicken sauce and thank you for dessert. <laughs> okay, so free dessert too. Thank you, Anna and, and Elena. I imagine Ellie lost the connection. If not, she would be here with you. I wanted to help you with, with at least one word. This one, uh, Anna, that is available. Available. Uh -huh, available. And the other one, inconvenience. Inconvenience, available, uh -huh. inconvenience. Yes. Right. Elena, could you repeat, please? Available, inconvenience. Inconvenience, thank you. Okay, we only have two more pairs, Juan Carlos and Omar and Jonathan Mayra. Juan Carlos and Omar, can you continue? Okay. Eh, bueno. Good morning, sir. The waiter told me your problem, but I should like to hear from you. I have quite long time my food. I order one hour to go. Excuse me. I go to I go to check your order and come back again. I order hamburger extra large with ribless. And don't resign my order this moment. So sorry. Uh, I check again. Uh, okay, mister. Your order is ready for service and for inconvenience. Your dinner is free. So sorry and enjoy. That's it, teacher. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Juan Carlos and Omar. Okay, just one comment. Eh, Juan Carlos, hay dos palabras que son similares. Está sir y está mister. Sir es el que podemos utilizar sin el nombre o el apellido. Sir. Pero mister, cuando utilizamos mister, se tendría que utilizar el last name, like Mr. Rivas or Mr. Hernández. Y si no conocemos el nombre, ahí sí podríamos ir con Sir y ahí. Just that change. But thank you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Jonathan and, and Mayra, can you help us with the last, with your role play, please? Okay. I share the screen. Maya, can you see? Okay. Hello, good morning. Hello. Welcome to your restaurant, Pollo Campestre. 
where I can serve you, your order would be to eat here or to take away? Away? Eat here, please. Okay. I'll like place here on your table and then you'll get to, to take your order. What would you like to order? I would like a hamburger with french fries and a salad and another child uh, combo. And what will you want to drink? Um, I like a lemon tea and some water. Sube la que no miro por. Ay, ay, ay. Anything else you want to add to the order? No, only. But you can leave me a menu in case I ask for something else. Okay, in a moment, we will serve you order. Okay, thank you very much. One hour later. Miss, look, I already have a long time to wait and don't know why they haven't attended me. I want to know if there is a problem with my order. Excuse me, mister, but if we have had a problem in the kitchen due to lack of staff and we have had a small delay in the orders, but you is coming right now, we will serve you. Here I bring you order, order and sorry for delay to solve it. We will give you a dessert and a coupon of 10% discount on your next purchase. Thank you very much. We have to see you soon again. Sorry for the inconvenience. Only teacher. Okay, thank you Mayra and, and Jonathan for helping us with the role play. Good pronunciation, both of you. You did very well with the pronunciation and the fluency. I like that. Maybe, maybe the only comment will be try to use a little bit more your own words. Traten de utilizar más sus propias palabras, aunque se equivoquen, ¿verdad? Para que practiquen más su, su grammar, ¿verdad? Lo, lo que aprendemos eh, day by day. But thank you. Thank you to all of you for your effort. I know it's difficult, but you are trying and that is what matters, okay? That is what counts. Okay, eh, about the posters, yo les estaré enviando ahí feedback personalmente a cada uno. Solo asegúrense de enviarlo todos y luego después de la clase I will read the ones I haven't read. Ya leí algunos, pero otros no. Entonces, a los que no les he contestado aún, I will give you feedback okay, about your, your posters. Okay, now let me go back to the book. Okay, in the book, if you remember, yesterday we talked about the most common issues with service. You have experience in a restaurant, okay? We talk about common problems. Okay, in this moment, we will talk about how to fix the problem using could, could, might, like or want. If you remember last week, we talked about these three options to give recommendations. La semana pasada hablamos de cómo dar recomendaciones, ¿verdad? To fix uh, recommendations. Okay, ¿qué vamos a hacer ahorita? In 10 minutes, with the person you were working with, you are going to find solutions for the problems. Okay, van a tratar de hacer oraciones encontrando las soluciones o lo que se podría hacer para arreglarlo. Okay, como por ejemplo, the waiter gets you your food. Sorry, the waiter gets you food you did not ask for. Okay, so what could be done in this case? ¿Qué se podría hacer en este caso? Cuando tenemos este problem. Do you have some some ideas? Oh, bueno, sorry. It's a little bit more about how to prevent those problems. Como 
I, I got confused with a different activity. Esta es about prevention, procedures to prevent. Esta es sobre cómo prevenir el, estos problemas. Okay, the waiter gets you food you didn't ask for. What could be done to reduce those issues? Okay, ¿Qué podemos hacer para reducir este problema? Problem number one. Do you have any ideas? Have to share a number page. Page uh, 17. Page 17. Okay, thank you. So what could help us to reduce problem number one? ¿Qué creen que se podría hacer para no tener el problem number one? The restaurant manager must take a, a better or a better procedure and check the procedure every every minute. Mm -hmm. uh, when the waiter take the order, the waiter um, carry on the order and put in the production line. Yes, that could be yeah. one solution. Thank you, Galileo. Uh, in in uh -huh. the production line, maybe there are confused. Uh, the, the restaurant manager must check this procedure. Uh, in in the production line. Uh huh. They have to check it very often to avoid the problem. Thank you, Galileo. So the idea is that you find things to prevent the inconvenience. O sea, tienen que dar recommendations para cómo prevenir estos problemas in the restaurant. Como les mencionaba, if you wish, you can use might, like or want, you can use could, or you could use other options, porque eso se utiliza para dar recommendations, right? The manager could check the orders often. That could be one solution. Or the waiter could repeat the, the order three times, slowly, porque a veces repiten super fast. Okay, entonces, ¿cómo prevenir these issues? Para practicar could, y estos que habíamos visto pueden utilizar eso. But if you want to use others, you can. Do you understand? Is it clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, it is. No questions? No. Okay, you have 10 minutes and write as many sentences as possible. ¿no? Pueden hablar de cualquiera de esos, todos los que puedan. Ten minutes, todas las, las recommendations that you can, that you can think of. Okay, I will change the groups a little bit. They will be a little bit bigger. We will have six groups, groups of three. Please open the room in 10 minutes. We will be back. Nine. 47. Estos son problemas, dijo, para resolver. Hi, everyone. I'm here visiting you very fast. So I'm just checking on you just to make sure that you understood the instruction of, of this activity. Was it clear? Eh, no, teacher. Es que, bueno, no. a mí me están llamando del trabajo y no, 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 yes. no puse mucha atención realmente. Solo, solo okay. entendí de, de, y, me, y me costó ubicar dónde están uh -huh. la, las cinco recomendaciones. It's okay. Ahorita les ayudo. 
hay diferentes problemas que se dan en, en los restaurantes, ¿verdad? Mencionábamos que estos son como los más comunes. La idea sí. es que ustedes digan unas recomendaciones para evitar estos inconvenientes. La semana pasada estudiamos could, might like y might want. Esas se utilizan para dar recomendaciones. Entonces, utilizando estas palabras, pueden ver, por ejemplo, esta dice, eh, the waiter is not polite. Ok, ¿qué puede hacer el restaurante para evitar este problema? Vaya, lo que ustedes mencionaron en su, en su role play. The company could give eh, trainings. Solo que esto sería como de que trainings de a customer service. Esto sería, digo yo, de customer service. Service training to employees. Ok, esta es una recommendation y estoy utilizando could. Entonces, eso es lo que ustedes tienen que hacer. Recommendations. Y tienen Get todas fighted. estas options. Uh -huh. Ok, yes. that could be another <laughs> solution, right? You're out. Uh -huh. Entonces, eso es lo que tienen que hacer. Utilizando could, might like, or might want, van a ver qué podemos hacer para evitar estos problemas. Ok. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Y solo tenemos yeah. like seven more minutes, pero todas las que puedan en, en seven minutes. Ok. okay. Thank you, y ahí se Thank pueden you. ayudar each other. If you need me, I'll come back. Ok. See you in a moment. Bye bye. Ok. Con, con, revise y review. Con review. Con review the order before, before. Before, before the order, before serving, uh -huh. before, before how are you doing? Servir. Uh huh. Before serving the food, do you need my help? Llevamos una una oración para una una teacher. Y escuché el cool y veo que le están haciendo solitos, así ustedes, invent, entre todos. Invent, invent, thank, thank you. you. Ajá. <ríe> Utilicen los que... Que el, que el orden de las palabras no sea el correcto es otra cosa, Tish. <ríe> Pero no okay. altera el producto, no altera el producto. <ríe> ok, I will let you continue in that case. I was just checking in case you needed yeah. me. See you thank in a moment. Teacher. Sería the manager. Cool. Cool. The cool. manager. Cool. 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 Here. Here. Here, uh -huh. here, here. Debería Sería contratar. Call. Call. Call here. Call here. Hi. Wait. Polite. Wait. Hi. Mm -hmm. What? Polite. Higher. <laughs> yes. Eh, do you uh, need higher. Here, Call higher. Ajá. Uh -huh. Así se escribe y se dice higher. Uh, And higher. how are you doing? Higher. ¿Cómo van? Van bien. Right. La primera. La primera. Ok. También podría sí. haber customer service training. Está para los compartí, ah. En WhatsApp compartí uno ahí. Restaurant call. Send the waiters to customer. To customer service. Call. Ah, ok. Vamos a la revista. Okay. Do you need so help? Sorry, Wendy. Mm -hmm. Could you turn down the volume of the TV? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. The restaurant. Uh, okay. The one you said the restaurant could send the waiters to, uh -huh, to customer service. 
courses or trainings? Yes. Oh, okay. Correct. Course training. Uh huh. Okay. So continue. Okay. I just wanted to check on to check on you. I'll see you in a moment. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye. Bye. Hello, Jenny. Hi, Omar. Hello. How are you Hi. doing? ¿Cómo van esas Miss. sentences? Miss, yes. es, es, eh, es obligatorio que usemos el meet like when. Oh, oh. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. okay. Okay, sorry. So, uh, no, it's not, it's not an obligation. It's not mandatory. You can use should too. That is another possibility to give recommendations. Should, could, might like, and might want are just other possibilities. Ah, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yes. It, it, it's, it's correct. It's, is manager should try estas staff frequently should try staff but what do you mean with that sentence is one well, number one the choir got you for you did know us for uh -huh. manager should try staff frequently should try but when you say try what do you mean ¿Qué significa el verbo try ahí para usted? Es como entrenamiento. Training. training. Ah, training. Yeah. Training. Train. Uh -huh. ah, yes. Ajá, yo estaba pensando en lo mismo. That they should or they could give customer service trainings. But it's the same. The same as used, just in other words. Yes. Okay. Mm. Do you need Thank my you. help? Mm -hmm. No. no. You're, you're okay. Okay, in two minutes, we will go back and then you can read the sentences, all the sentences you have. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome.
Okay, welcome back. Um, Mayra, sorry, you were working alone, right? Estaba solita, ¿verdad, Mayra? Yes, I'm sorry. Estaba visitando sus compañeros y ahorita vi que, que estaba solita. I'm sorry that I couldn't, I couldn't send you to another place. So, Mayra, can you read your sentences? Just let me share the book. And, okay, for problem number one, Mayra, do you have some solutions, recommendations? Mm -hmm. The waiter get you food you did not ask for. Mm -hmm. Vaya, teacher, no sé si tan buena, pero le hice dos, le voy a decir. Uh -huh. You can repeat the order, number one. And number two, you might like someone check the order before serving them. You might like someone check the order before, before? serving them. Mm -hmm. Yes, correct. Do you have more, more sentences, Mayra? Solo esa y esa. Okay, thank you, Mayra, but they are correct. Okay, let's listen to Jenny and Omar. Can you share your recommendations, Jenny and Omar? Just tell me the problem that you are talking about. Um, Solo nos faltó el último, pero el primero era eh, manager soul train staff frequently. Mm -hmm. eh, the second, que es the food takes too long to be served after ordering it. Colocamos manager soul review the procedure to make sure it is behind done. Okay. Uh, el tercero, the weather is not polite. Uh, the waiter could take a training when he doesn't follow the poli police policies. Uh -huh. Yes, uh -huh. that's a good idea. In, in the fourth, the dish you want to order is not available, but it appears listening to menu. Um, colocamos the menu show check and update monthly. Ah, okay. Y hasta ahí, hasta ahí llegamos. Yes, to update the menu, that is a good idea to avoid the inconvenience. Thank you, Jenny and Omar. Okay, just to the pronunciation, Jenny, I will help you with this word. This one is appears. Appears? Appears. Polite. Uh -huh. Appears, polite. Polite. Okay, thank you. Wendy, Nelson, and Rodrigo, do you, what are the recommendations you have for problem number one? Okay. Uh, number one, uh, only, only one, Miss. Mm -hmm. uh, the way the way they call read the order in the notebook in confirmation two times. Mm -hmm. For problem number two? Uh, uh, no, uh, number, three. number three. Number three. Number three. Problem number three. Okay. The waiter is not polite. Uh -huh. uh, the restaurant calls send the waiter to customer service training. Mm -hmm. Number four? Uh, no, uh, for same. Same ah, problem. the same problem. Mm -hmm. Yes. The manager call hire waiters polite. Mm -hmm. Polite waiters. Thank you. Polite waiters. Problem sorry. number five or four. I'm sorry, four or five? No, teacher. No. Okay, oh, but yeah, so. the I'm sentences sorry. are correct. Thank you. Oscar, Elena, and Laura. Problem number one. Recommendations. Y the waiter could review the order before service full on the table. Uh, mm -hmm. The waiter could repeat the order before taking it to the kitchen. Mm -hmm. 
problem two. Pero no en or, uh, no, ah, no okay. orden, teacher. Uh, What is the next problem? Hicimos the restaurant my life how a waiting time of 30, 30 minutes to serve the food order. And Ella. that is for problem two. Ah, el segundo, sí. Ah, that's from, <laughs> y, to have a waiting time. Hicimos una cuarta que estábamos a media, pusimos the manager could review the menu periodically to remove, remove the no available menu. Ah, okay. No, por Thank you. Que no está. Hasta solo, ahí, solo la palabra manager, Laura. Manager, 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 y periodically or frequently. Okay, okay. Thank mm -hmm. you, teacher. Thank you, but good sentences as well. Carlos, Jonathan, and Zaira. It's your turn. Teacher, I, I can share the screen. Yes, you can. Yeah. Uh, But um, I think it was because I was nos, sharing. Nosotros, nosotros solo hicimos uno, pero hicimos varios. O sea, eso uh -huh. entendimos. Uh -huh, it's the, okay. the, way, the, the waiter is not polite. Mm -hmm. The restaurant could give customer service training to employees. Mm -hmm. The restaurant might like hear experience service. The manager might want to follow up on these is issues. The restaurant could could give could give day off the employees for a good service. Uh -huh. The restaurant might like to change the employees. The manager might like to call attention for the waiter. Oh, okay, but good good ideas, good recommendations. Uh, about the the sentences, I see that sentence number two doesn't have to. Veo que a la dos sí se, se les olvidó agregar el to. Los otros sí tienen my want to, my like to, solo ahí. Y hire, Carlos. That is the correct pronunciation of that word. My like to hire experienced hire. servers. Thank you. Uh -huh. Just those two points. Then we have Galileo, Juan Carlos, and Ana. May I share my screen, ma'am? Of course. Um, I am so sorry because I don't, I don't be uh, polite or polite. Well, number one is the waiter gets you food you did not ask for. The waiter could repeat the order to the customer at least three times. Also, the restaurant's manager must check the order the order in the production line. Number two, the food takes too long to be served after ordering, ordering it. Uh, the production lines must take a lot of employees on the rush hour. Rush hour is a term uh, we use in restaurants uh, because yes. the demand increase in those times. Number three, the waiter is not polite. The company needs to give training to the whole employees, at least retraining each six months, training about customer services. Number four, the dish you want to order is not available, but it appears listed in the menu. The, menu. Uh, the full stock in the restaurant must be a note, a note to cover the daily demand. Demand. Number five, the dish in the menu differs from the actual dish the waiter brings to be to the table. The marketing department needs to review the menu frequently to check it. If the menu have some changes, they must update It's every three month, month. Okay, that is all. Thank you, Galileo. It looks good as well, other ideas. And most of you have the same idea about updating the menu, right? In that way, the customer only has 
the available options. Thank you. Mm -hmm. But excellent job, all of you. You use good, should, might want to, might like to in the correct way. Now I will take the attendance and then I will stay with Galileo, okay? Galileo's turn. So Ana Beatriz. Present. Ana Lilian, Brian Javier. Carlos Antonio. Present. Okay. Elizabeth Martinez, Jose Arnoldo, Jose Galileo. Okay, Galileo. Present. Yes. Okay. Jonathan Vigil. Present. Okay. Jose Rodrigo. Present. Juan Carlos. Present. Laura Carolina. Present. Okay. Ma María Concepción. María Elena. Mayra Moreno. Present. Okay. Present. Okay. And Nelson. Nelson Gavarrete. I, I hear Miss. Omar Francisco. Present. Oscar Arnulfo. Present. Zaira Marleni. Present teacher. Wendy Maribel. Present teacher. Jenny Santos. Present. Okay, thank you. So you guys are free to go. See you tomorrow. Sweet dreams bye. to all of you. Bye-bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. 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 Okay, just one moment, Galileo. We will wait a little bit. And... I'm going to... Okay, so now it's just you and I. How are you doing, Galileo? Uh, I can't complain. You can. How is your uh, health? It's, is it better than yesterday? Uh, I have a lot of doubt because the last week I practically I I I were aus absent. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I I were connected, but really I don't really put attention. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is very difficult to to pay attention when you're feeling sick. So, yeah. uh -huh. so it's understandable. Uh, but yes, you, you sound better. Mm -hmm. You are more active in the class. That means that your health is, is improving. By the way, I read the, I read the message you sent about the procedure. So, okay, I'm a little bit maybe curious or confused. So do you work in a restaurant, Galileo? Because I can see that I you talk about those. Uh -huh. I work in Papa John's Pizza. I I am QCC manager. Oh, QCC, you are QCC means quality control center manager. Ah, okay. So you check the dough, as I can see here, bacteria, how to avoid bacteria. Ah, okay. Now I understand. Yeah, we going. we we use some procedures like uh, good manufacturing practice, a hazard analysis, and critical control point, HACCP, and mm. a fuel security or fuel safety. Uh, there are that are uh, procedures to uh, warranty the. La inocuidad, the warranty. Is it like the, the hygiene? Hmm? Is it like the hygiene you're talking about? I'm talking about uh, fuel, food safety, safety. The safety of food. Ah, yeah. okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it seems. We, like, mm -hmm. Sorry. Yeah. We 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 have. The, those procedure and I am working I work in the plant but I have so 
no conocimiento, knowledge. knowledge. Uh -huh. I have some knowledge about the production line in the restaurant too. I, I know how the waiters uh, give the service. I know how the, the employees make the pizza in the restaurant. And I, I have knowledge about all operation in the plant, in the restaurant too. Ah, okay. So yeah, the one you sent, it was about the entrance, right? Things you have to do before, before entering inside the company or the building. I can see yeah. it, it's like a sanitizing. I see that it's like a sanitizing pro protocol or procedure. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, we have sanitizer protocol to start to make the dough pizza and yes. we have to pro protocol to visit people who visit the plant. Uh -huh. okay. That is but the protocol. I'm sorry. Sorry, I was going to say that it was correct, but I got curious because I didn't really understand. I remember you told me that you were a quality, a quality agent, but I wasn't sure how it was related to Papa John's, but now I understand that you are a quality uh, manager in that restaurant. Yeah, yeah. It is, it's common sense. I, I take control to sanitizer in plant and in the same restaurant. The people need to take your headnet your mask, not for pandemia, not by pandemia. No, it, the mask is used, uh, it's to common avoid, use. Mm -hmm. It's common use to avoid the bacteria from from mouth to the dose or pizza. Mm -hmm. it's, it's common sense. I use my protocol in, in the plant in the same in restaurant. So I, I don't know what more I can say. <laughs> okay, okay, Galileo. And tell me, how could I help you? Do you want to check or reinforce a topic of the class, your reading, or what would you like to do in the next minutes? Uh, I, I have clear all your class. You are a great teacher. And Thank you. I admire teacher. I don't remember. Admire. I admire your patient and your uh, way to learn English. Mm, thank you. I appreciate it. I, I, I don't have any doubts about the class. I understand because, but, but I can't. Uh, retain by heart <laughs> or, or worse I can it's difficult it requires practice that area you're talking about memorizing or memorization it will be difficult so yeah. that is why I usually try to repeat the steps like okay let's do it again 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 because practice makes makes it better, right? So that is what we need. And in your case, I'm glad that you can speak and you can express your ideas, but for some of your classmates, that is very difficult. So they need to practice even more, right? So that is what we have yeah. to do, practice. Yeah, uh, to be honest, I don't practice during the day. Mm -hmm. I just practice in two hours, two class hours. Ah, okay. And all you've learned, has it been here in the classes or how did you learn English in the past? Uh, ah, in the, uh, formally, I just, I was, four months in the E4CC, 
is E4CC English for call center. I just oh. was four months, but I leave the course. Uh, after that or before that, I don't have any formal course. Just, mm. just I like hear music. I like uh, uh, see a uh, watch TV movies, but uh, formally I don't have any classes. So only the four months you study there, and the INSA for course in this moment. Yeah, yes only. And which module did you start in? Because right now you are in the intermediate level, number one, right? But when yeah. did you start in basic one? Basic, basic one. Basic one, okay. Basic so. one. I, I am, I begin the course, I start in the course from zero. It's a good idea. It's a good idea. You always learn little things, but we always learn new vocabulary, new words. So I, I yeah. think it's a good start actually start. actually i learned a lot in basic in the sixth module of basic mm -hmm. i learned a lot yes it has a lot of business vocabulary right the the yeah. next level intermediate two that one is about the the production line it has a lot of words related to that screening uh, protocol, prototype, and a lot of words related to that. And yes, I yeah. think it's a very good course because they teach you English, but they also teach you about other things, like in this moment about the restaurant industry and how it works. So I think it's a very nice, nice course. Yeah, the, the, the words you, you show us today is familiar. Familiar is, is right? They familiar. are familiar. Uh -huh. Familiar, familiar to me. Like uh, a hand. Hand washing. Hand washing, a sanitizer. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, those are familiar words to me. Yes. Because, because Papa Jones is a North American mm -hmm. frank, franchise. Mm -hmm. uh, the manual uh, uh, they send the manual in English mm -hmm. so I learned some words there yes yes they use a lot of English even the name right Papa John's so it's like a mix like yeah. English so yes I imagine that you also I imagine that sometimes you have people from other countries or people from the U.S. visiting the branches yeah. here, right? So yeah, uh, okay. I have communication with QCC manager from Orlando, Florida, and we talk just only from by email or by WhatsApp. Mm -hmm. I I can. Uh, take a conversation with WhatsApp, a little conversation, obviously, <laughs> by WhatsApp or or email. I can I can sustain it, teacher. Sustain. I can keep or maintain. Uh, yeah, I can keep a conversation by email or by WhatsApp but uh, I can't talk, I can't talk, it's difficult to me. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, we will be practicing more the speaking, the speaking area in the next classes and pronunciation, pronunciation as well to help you with those parts. But I'm glad, I'm glad that you feel comfortable with the group and with the classes and whenever you need help, text me, okay? And I can try to, to help you out. Thank you, ma. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. Okay. All right, Galileo. So I think in that case we will stop here. I will I will check your well not yours but the the posters your classmates sent, 
and we will continue tomorrow. I don't know if you have okay. any questions before we finish no. the session. No, 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 everything is okay. Okay, Galileo. Well, sweet dreams, and I hope to see you tomorrow in the class. All right. Thank you. You too. Bye bye. Good night.